Hey everybody, today is Saturday, September 10th, 2022 in sunny San Diego, California, and I am Captain Perry here with you. If you're new to the channel, behind me here is a scow bow mini cruiser that I'm building. Basically my mission here is to build a strong, trailerable, 14-foot sailboat that's watertight and custom built to cross oceans. Behind me here you can see my crude doghouse template set up so that I can try and get an idea of the right height for it. This is set at 18 centimeters and I think it looks not only visually appealing but good functionality as well. I also went ahead and increased the hatch size to 47 centimeters. So let's see what that looks like. That's better. This time my shoulders don't get stuck coming through. Beginning today, I'm going to start work on the aft deck panel. Now I know at the very least we need to begin this project by laminating a foam core rectangle approximately 112 centimeters by 128 centimeters, referring to my 1 tenth scale model. Then we'll worry about attaching a structural grid to the underside. And I'm going to do all that on the piece upside down prior to flipping it over and epoxying it into place. That way we get as much fiberglass work as we can done while the piece is off the boat. Okay, let's get to it. My rudder has the usual external tiller, but it also has an internal tiller so that you have the option of steering from inside the doghouse or out on deck. Part of my design requires that I install a vertical one inch shaft through the deck. To help distribute the forces this shaft will encounter, I'm epoxying on this oak block and a couple G10 pieces. The G10 disc you just saw me make will replace the foam core in the deck. 
I've made this oak shaft housing from the same white oak I made the three keel beams out of. So this shaft housing will be mounted underneath the aft deck, right where it meets the transom.
是 Cable Show Cable. Okay, well, I've just finished sanding the edges of the aft deck panel.、Uh, I don't call this a cockpit panel because there's no footwell, and really, I want the focus of all the navigation and controlling the boat to be right from the main hatch. So this is just an aft deck. Uh, there will be an external tiller here, but as you can see, there's an internal tiller as well, and controls for all the sheets and reefing and everything should be able to be done by the main hatch. Let me know what you think of this system or the video or anything in the comments, please. A big thank you to all my patrons. The Patreon members get access to a full build photo gallery and some other benefits along with、uh, watching videos one day in advance. So if you join that, it helps me out. Also, just give a like and a comment if that's all you want to do. And there's other great ways to support the project down in the description. You can check, like、uh, especially Amazon wish list. You can get some of these items, and they'll get sent directly to me. This will just be part one. This piece actually requires a lot of work. And next, I got to start attaching the structural grid. It'll have a bunch of structural beams attached to it in this kind of layout. So I will see you guys next time for attaching the structural grid to the underside of the aft deck. See you. Well, now let's make all preparations for getting underway. Hey, what's your name? Home. Public, get back to your station, or I'll have you shot from this chair. Well, shoot some.